More people continue to get packed into the inland northwest, but there aren't enough homes to go around. Investors are back to buying, which means there are even less options. Redfin says investors snatched up one out of every seven single family homes on the market. Now, this is a change in trend that's keeping more people from finding a place to call home. Esther Bauer is live tonight to break down how it's affecting the market. Esther. Investor purchases have been declining for the past three quarters, but they're back on the rise. And these investors are buying less expensive options, many homes that first time home buyers would be able to afford. Why not go to Spokane? A question drawing a lot of people into the booming city. More people want to live here, and investors see it as an opportunity. Unfortunately, with the shortage of supply and a lot of cashed up investors, then the investors are able to pay cash, waive any contingencies, and then buy the property without a mortgage. Now that's a fairly unique situation. James Young has studied real estate markets and trends for over 25 years. He says these investors are buying homes they can rent, purchasing properties for other family members, or even flipping them to make a hefty profit. There hasn't been a lot of supply coming up in the past few years. So that makes it even worse. Even worse because investors are beating out first time home buyers. So they're forced to stay renting, lowering vacancies and driving up rent. With rental rates going up, sure, it's going to make it more attractive for investors to buy those types of houses. And until more homes can hit the market, this issue will continue and more people are left unable to buy a home. There's no quick solution to this, right? It took years to get into this situation and I'm afraid it's going to take a while to get out of it. And James says as a way that we can help this supply issue is to re remove some of the hoops and permitting it takes to get homes on the market. He says as soon as we see more homes starting to hit the market faster, we'll see our market level out. Reporting live in Spokane tonight, Esther Bauer, 4 News Now.